There we go. Sorry about that. Okay. <clears throat> Alright, so first of all, we need to know what socks is. What are you even talking about when you say socks? Okay. Well, it's the United States of America federal law since July 30th of 2002. It was basically designed to protect investors by improving the accuracy and reliability of corporate disclosures. And SOX was passed mainly because of corporate and accounting crimes by Enron and WorldCom. These crimes became an issue of failing public trust for accounting and reporting practices. Um, SOX is named after U.S. Senator Paul Sarbanes, who's a Democratic from Maryland, and United States Representative Michael G. Oxley, and he is a Republican from Ohio. Some other names for SOX are Public Company Accounting Reform and Investor Protection Act in the Senate and Corporate and Auditing Accountability and Responsibility Act in the House. So, we need to understand what does SOX have to do with IT and security? Well, IT security controls may have been able to prevent and or detect frauds within companies like Enron and WorldCom. Those who are committing frauds against a company have to obtain illegal or unauthorized access to IT systems. Then they are able to continue or conceal the frauds. IT security controls are also able to help companies verify compliance with other legal and regulatory requirements. So it would be important to con control processes that provide for issues like access control, detection of unusual account or access activity, checks and balances for records relating to financial reporting. And with IT security, you may be able to provide early warnings for such fraudulent activity. So now we're going to see how will SOX impact me in doing my job or help the company that I work for? You see, SOX helps to allow you to trust all the data, not just financial reporting data. SOX enables web-based authentication by using usernames and passwords. Microsoft Passport and digital certificates that are stored on a user's computer or on hardware, smart cards, tokens, or biometric devices. It enables strong authentication in client-server environments by helping to ensure that only authenticated users are able to access sensitive information contained in encrypted files, folders, and email messages. So, after viewing this video, I hope that you have a good idea of what SOX is. SOX is also known as Starbucks, Sarbanes Oxley, and I hope that you also understand what SOX has to do with IT and security, and how will SOX impact me in doing my job or help in the company that I work for. Thank you, and have a great day. Goodbye.